In this video, we will review the use of a 45 degree holder, scribing a sample on the flip scribe at 45 degrees, and cleaving the sample. Start with samples that are about 3 quarters of an inch or 20 millimeters on a side. Place the holder on the flip scribe, but make sure the rails are locked in position. Then take the hold down with the flat facing you. Take your sample, put it uh, in the corner of the holder. Uh, there is a V at the bottom of the hold down to hold a corner of the sample. And I'm going to take that V and slide it up over the corner of the sample uh, to hold it in place. Here is a zoom view of the sample in the hold down. Now that the sample is held, I know that I can slide it over the, uh, the uh, diamond scribe. Now I'm going to just position the sample for the area of interest. I'm going to now slide the sample over the diamond scriber. I'm holding the hold down on the edge just to keep it steady and you can hear it scribe. There I've got my scribe. Now I can either cleave over the diamond scribe or I can use some other method to uh, cleave my sample. Now that I've Scribe the sample, and I'm going to go and cut and cleave this over a straight pin. Uh, and in this case, I'm using a tungsten wire. Um, so I just lay the sample so that it's straddling the pin, and now I'm going to push on either side. And there's my sample. Here's the cleave sample. It is also possible to cleave the sample using clean break cleaving pliers or cleaving the sample over the actual diamond scribe on the flip scribe. 